We have a new friend, and it's not Patrick. Me, not Knuckle. This guy has 5,000 health. We have an axe that does very little damage. We need a better weapon. And in order to achieve that, we're going to use this. I don't know how to say it, but I know there's a cool sword in here. Let's get working on it. You need an attuned diamond. This takes mana from the world for right now. So you just hold it in your hand, right click, and it builds up. We need over 5,000 for what we're about to do. So we're going to use a different way of getting more mana. We need emeralds, diamonds. Take a mortar and pestle, get some diamond powder, and some emerald powder. We also need a dagger, right? We need one of these too. We're going to take a barrel. We're going to put a barrel down right here. We're going to take the dagger. We're going to stab ourselves. Ow. And then we're going to draw a circle here. No. We're going to take the dagger. And we're going to stab ourselves. Ow. And we're going to draw a circle here. No. We're going to take the dagger. We're going to stab ourselves. And we're going to draw a circle here. Put this down. We're going to take a dagger. We're going to stab ourselves and we're going to draw a circle right here. Perfect. First try. Nailed it. Now we're going to take a barrel and we're going to put a barrel there. Now, what was the thing? One diamond, two emeralds. Need one diamond, two emeralds. One diamond, two emeralds. Pop that in there. That's a durability exchange something. Now what we're going to do, we're going to take a diamond, two sticks, and we're going to make a shovel. We're going to teach this thing, two sticks, diamond makes a shovel, put a pattern in a crafter. We need an exporter. Crafting upgrade. Wait. So now what we can do is we can go like so. And we can put an exporter right on there. If I click on this, I put the crafting upgrade in this slot. Take the diamond shovel. Put it in there. This thing's going to fill up with diamond shovels. And this is going to take durability from the shovel put it into our mahu which you can see in the top left hand corner which is kind of low it's only 111 we need to keep exercising it apparently so keep right clicking when it builds up and fill up this thing the attuned diamond got to get it to 5000 for now all right now that we have a decent amount of mana in our attuned diamond I came over here because I figured these guys wanted to watch what was about to happen to their friends. We need to do this. Power consolidation. Two powder diamonds, one emerald. So we got to do the same thing. Stab yourself with a dagger. Right click, holding it in your hand. And then draw a mahu circle. It was two powder diamonds, one emerald. Eat them. <laughs> do we have 5,000? We do. All right, so now the last thing that we need to do for the first step is take a diamond sword with the enchantment, toss it into the lake. Oh, sword in the lake. Now we got to find this thing. There it is. We have a caliburn or something it's called. Yes. 
And we need to take this guy. Go back to our new friend. Mr. Not. Mr. Not Knuckle. Knuckle, close your eyes. We now have a Morgan sword. And we need to level it up because this thing only does seven attack damage for now. But the way you level this up is we're going to use villagers. And you have to kill a bunch of villagers to get this thing leveled up. Yeah, 12.5. After killing 2,300 villagers, we now have the Morgan Sword at its top level. Apparently, all the Moz devs put a cap on this, which they didn't have in the past, but it does 103.5 attack damage. Not bad. And I added more of these durability exchanges. This is five wide. Still using the same thing, diamond shovel. Just because it's one diamond, it has the same amount of durability as any other diamond tool, but you only use up one diamond. So we're done with the villagers. Let's go test this thing out. See how it works at our 4,000 HP. This guy. Where you at, bro? It only hits him for 10. Oh, what? Kind of an uneventful ending, but I'm gonna say now's a good time to wrap up the video. Thanks for watching y'all. Have fun and peace.